Good morning and welcome to Greedy Beauty's Lovely Lux. Excuse my appearance. I just woke up. So today I'm just talking a little bit about what I'm going to be doing moving forward as far as income. So basically I'm going to start doing dinners. I'm still doing my lock extensions um, as an as needed basis um, through Etsy. But um, I think I'm just going to go the route of working at home instead of I absolutely hate my nine to five job. It's um, not good for my mental health and well being and health overall. It's just not a good idea to stay there. I've been there for three years. It's time to move on. So, you guys know I was going to school to get my license for cosmetology, but I don't need that to make lock extensions. So, that was a waste of my time. Um, I guess I'm now, with that being said, on Friday, no, Saturday, February 1st, I am selling Rasta pasta, vegetable, chicken, and beef. So it's jerk chicken, jerk vegetables, and jerk shrimp with the Rasta pasta. My fiance was telling me I should get my serve safe license in order to, like, legally, you know, serve food. It's a squirrel. <laughs> I swear I have ADD. But, anyways. My fiance is so supportive. He's very supportive. But if he sees this video with me with this robe and this bonnet on my head, he's going to kill me. <laughs> he is going to kill me. He is not a fan of this, okay? <laughs> so me selling these dinners on the 1st of February, um, it's just like a test run. It's mostly for friends and families, people that I actually know because I do not want strangers coming to my house until I can get like a delivery thing, you know, worked out. So in the past, what I had been doing is basically catering. I would do small events and parties, and that was mostly friends and families as well, which I did make a lot of money, but it was too few and far, you know, in between. So now me, I know what some of you negative people might say, okay, you're doing hair and, and food and catering in the same area. No, it's in the same house establishment, but it's in two totally different places. So don't get it twisted, okay? Don't make me come for, Don't come for me, and I will not come for y'all, okay? Let's just get that out of the way. Anyway, I'm a very clean person, naturally, anyway, and I'm not stupid, so I got this. My so video was all over the place as usual. I'm just talking, just throwing in things that as they come to mind. But um, if y'all have any comments, um, suggestions about the lock extensions or cooking, please let me know. And another thing I forgot to mention, I have 95 subscribers on YouTube now. Let's get it, that number to 100 so I can get, you know, amped. Y'all gotta get me excited, okay? And I will have a giveaway prize. Once I know what that is, I'll let you know. So my fiance, he's a barber and he's also gonna get his cosmetology license and he may open a salon slash barber shop which I intend on managing, but I ain't tell him that yet, so shh. Um, but we're gonna do so this. I'm gonna try to make a lot more videos. I'm gonna try to go live while I'm making certain recipes, um, you know, putting together recipes, making certain dishes. Um, when I do my catering jobs, throw clips in there, just kind of vlog my day, you know what I mean? If anyone has any suggestions on how I should do a giveaway since I've never done one before, when I hit that 100 subscriber mark, please leave a comment down below. Also, you know, as far as how to go about it, like the rules, or do I make it a game, or you know what I mean? Like the first person that does this, or I don't know. But once I hit the 100 subscriber mark, what do I do from there? You know what I mean? As far as it's selecting. a blessing and a curse when you're multi talented. So if you like this video, have any suggestions, leave a comment below. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Do not forget to hit the post notification bells, guys, so you don't miss a beast. I love you guys. Thanks for supporting me. Thanks to all of my 95 subscribers who've been rocking out with me. All right. Peace, love, and hair grease. <laughs> see you when I see ya.